Well, hi there, everyone. Guess what this hat and this shirt means? What it means is this Sunday is Pentecost, and I'm making this video just to make sure that you get to hear a couple of announcements. The first announcement is that I am going to be at the church Sunday morning from about 10 a.m. till 12 noon, no doubt dressed in my Pentecost fineness. And I have some things that I want to give away. And they are red. And they might even look a little bit like this. So I would ask if you want to drive by the church Sunday morning and receive your Pentecost blessings. Well, I guess that's a blessing. I promise I'll wear a gloves and a mask. The second thing I want to share with you is actually bigger. On Tuesday evening, the elders of our church voted to cautiously open up this church for worship on Sunday, June 21st, assuming that Indiana County is in the green phase and we have indications that it will be. And by cautious, I mean when we gather on June 21st, masks will be recommended there will not be singing. Social distancing will be recommended, as will uh, the lack of congregating before and after worship. We're not going to have any passing of the peace or fellowship time, the passing of offering plates. Communion is not going to take place for a while. We're not even going to use printed bulletins. We will have as much as of the liturgy on the screens as we can. For several reasons, worship will be shorter. Now, our bathrooms will be open, but we will encourage you to use your facilities at home. And I'm sure there's going to be some other smaller temporary changes to begin with. And our prayer is that our worship is going to become more normal in the not-so-distant future as we see improvement in the overall situation, not just in our county, but certainly in our state, the country, and around the world. Please continue to be in prayer about that. If you in any way are at a high risk, and sometimes that's defined as being age 65 or older, or you have some underlying conditions, feel free to stay home for your own well-being. As a matter of fact, if you are in any way uncomfortable about coming to worship while we are in the green phase, please know that you're welcome to do or not do as you feel led, please. If you are ill, we would ask you to stay home. We'll see you when you feel better. We'll see you when things just get better. Now, for those who stay home and you have internet access, we plan to continue to offer online worship opportunities. But I, I'm going to need some help to do this. We need, or I need, to figure out a few things. And if you are tech savvy and willing to work with me on this, please let me know because I'm, I'm going to need the help. I know this has been a difficult time for all of us, and for some of you, it's been far more difficult than it has been for Susie and I, and probably more difficult than I can even begin to imagine. I have, as I'm sure you have, spent much time praying, and I urge us all to continue to pray. But while we do that, let's give thanks to God for what he has done for us, what he's doing for us right now, and what he will do as we move into the future. We can count on this. God bless you and have a wonderful day.